I'm Ido and uh, we are in the Alpa um, booth here on Fotokina uh, looking at uh, new cameras and uh, buddies from Alpa and uh, we have here Andre Eldadi who will uh, show us a bit of the new uh, products uh, that Alpa has here on the booth. Yeah. So first of all, uh, thank you for being here and uh, uh, to introduce Alpa. It is uh, Alpa started 12 years ago. It is an old brand. It got ranked up in the 90s. It it started like a Swiss Leica, and uh, what the idea behind the whole concept was to have it completely modular, to have a high-end, then back then film camera. Uh, which is now absolutely capable. Even the first Alpa from 12 years ago is absolutely a high-end, also digital camera. So when we go to this here, that was that's the original what, where we started. It is uh, a modular six up to six by nine film camera, and modular means everything is interchangeable. So it is like Lego. If you know Lego, um, you have the lenses, you have a body with some functionality. And, of course, you have a film back back then and today a digital back. So, what is here special with this, that was absolutely first model, is you have a shift capacity for, and here we are with the target audience, is architectural photographer, landscape photographers, uh, it, they are uh, fine art photographers, uh, at the moment also commercial and especially also industrial photographers. Everything is made in Switzerland. Uh, it is milled out of the concrete alloy. So, of course, we have, we have to be honest, the, the lenses are from Germany because only the Schneider and Rodenstock are producing those lenses. The, also, the thing with Alpa is because we are thinking uh, modular, when you're on a tripod, as a, as a little goodie, when you see, and you want to go from landscape to portrait. You do not have to change the camera like with a digital one. You just go here, you go here, here, and then you turn and off you go. So everything started with this here. It's mechanical. It is, it is, it works also with minus 30 degrees without problems. So that's the reason why a lot of photographers were investing into this system because it is an investment. It's not so cheap. So this, we started here. We went over with technical cameras. You have over there with, uh, with movements, shift capacities, etc. But for example, because everything is interchangeable, our smallest model, you see it here now, the camera itself is just a frame and you can, you can use all the equipment with everything together. And our absolutely newest model that we are showing uh, for the first time now here for Photokina is something in between. So we, we ask the customers and say, well, what is the most important thing you need? And a lot of them are now with digital backs. So they want to have megapixels. They want to have megapixels for their exhibitions or whatever. So we started with also with these cameras with stitching. Stitching means not only one picture, but one, two, putting it together. So, the newest one and the smallest one here is uh, a camera, it's called STC, S stands for stitching and shifting. So, you see, you can just do it very fine, geared, you can block it, but you can also just, for the stitching, unlock it and click, click, second picture. So, there you can also, when the weather is changing and so, uh, fast, fast uh, clouds, etc. You can go and you can really do good stitching. Uh, we had a lot of campaigns also for Range Rover and so photographers were using this because they need megapixels. It is very small, it is very accurate um, and you can do, you can interchange everything from the lenses, from the body. So, the basic idea, somebody is, is investing into Alpa, he loves photography, and he can also work with one thing and then grow up with the rest. So what we're also showing here is a little bit good is like this. Uh, we made an iPhone holder. Why an iPhone holder? Uh, one thing is just because we thought it's fun. You see, it is a lot of photographers have the iPhone. 
uh, or devices like that. It can be an Android, uh, uh, um, uh, mobile device, and they have apps. And for example, they, ha they want to have apps emulating a viewfinder. It's like this. It's emulating a viewfinder. Where is it? Here it is. And you can also pitch in. You can gray it out. You can save it. You have the GPS coordinates and everything. Of course, this is only a start because it is a so mobile platform and a so modular platform as the Alpa is. Uh, we can think of additional applications for steering electronic shutters, uh, for future applications, and even it be it a notepad to put down some notes. And you see, as we are always doing it, it is modular, it is changeable so that you have special, uh, special advantages, and of course it is landscape and portrait. Where is it? Here it is. So it works like this. Maybe these are just goodies, but we think it is uh, it is just a start, also to show uh, that we are interested in uh, in uh, in combining things. Uh, by the way, we are one of the well, I would say one of the oldest companies using the web. So we decided we the first web Alpha website was introduced in 1996, so some 14 years ago. Uh, and uh, and till then, we are really we are using the web also to communicate. We are really we can say we are um, uh, we are interactive and we are worldwide uh, available for our customers because we are a small company. We we have the ideas. We have our machine shops. We let them make, um, and it is really it's the the focus is precision is. We want to do nice things. We want to because we love photography, so we want to share it also with the, with uh, a lot of photographers. You have here an art photographer, Walter Niedermeyer. You have Melantin. He is uh, he is a commercial photographer from Germany. Uh, so we are talking we are talking from art to commercial, everything. And so everybody is sharing the same idea. Everybody is sharing the same love for photography. And we think uh, in the whole ocean of other things. We want to be something special, we want to remain something special and uh, we have more a friendly relationship and a friendship with our customers and try to keep it like that. That's also the reason why sometimes you say no, maybe this camera is not for you. So I wouldn't do I wouldn't do sports with it. I was this this uh, this spring I was in New York. What happened? The first photographer came and said, well you see I did the basketball game with it. So you never know what is happening with it. So that's it. Alpa is a very small company. We are a very special company. We want to keep it like this. Uh, we are not just about growing. Uh, we are just about photography and we will see what the future brings. We have our niche and we do not fear others. But so I think we can, we can offer one of the highest qualities in the world which is achievable with the highest and the finest gear. So that's it. Thank you very much.